So right now, fans across the state getting ready to uh, watch the tip off. It's just about an hour away. Steve Solis is joining us now from Fremont tonight where fans and businesses are excited for the game. Steve. Yeah, Greg Joyce, good evening. We are actually outside the Dock Sports Bar and Grill. This is where typically fans and alumni of Gonzaga gather to watch any game. But this game is much different. This is for the national title and a chance to become the first undefeated team in 45 years to win that title. You can see here there are fans all over this tent just kind of gathering right now. Of course, there are still some fans who need to show up here. And some of the people who are here, they actually took the day off of work and have been sitting here for much of the day. The one thing you will notice, though, that these tables here are pretty spread out, meaning uh, you probably want to call this COVID full. So every restaurant here in Washington, as we know, is operating under phase three COVID restrictions. Sarah Peterson, actually, her family owns the Dock Sports Bar and Grill. And she explained to us how they are working to keep Zags fans safe from COVID-19. We followed all the recommended guidelines in terms of social distancing, tables six feet apart. Um, even though we erected the tent outside, we've put only two sides on that and we've left two sides of open airflow to ensure that we've got um, a nice airflow happening out there so that it is truly an outdoor space. So the precautions here at this restaurant, just like any others, very, very tight. They're making sure that, of course, we have limited seating throughout this restaurant. They know that this place is going to fill up and we see people in line trying to get out into this place. They have to be checked in uh, by staff before they do come in. Now the fans who are gathered here hope the Bulldogs can finish this season undefeated. We are live in Seattle's Fremont neighborhood. Steve Solis, King 5 News. Steve, I hope they don't wait until the very, very last shot like they did the last game. Can they please not do that?